Well, that was risky. He could have left the red on. There was no colour available, but didn't like the snooker escape. Red on the left side cushion is forcing Jimmy to play this off three cushions. And he's missed the ball completely. But fortunately, <laughs> he hit the other red. And somehow it's gone safe. safety this time from Anthony Hamilton Thank you. well this has got to be just the paint and that's all he can hit by the looks of it yeah forced him into playing a good shot that Anthony Hamilton's pot success today, just 82. That doesn't normally cut it at this level. Got to be careful not to push him over this left corner. And that's just what he's done. Now, uh, can Jimmy see it? Well... Wouldn't like to be taking that one on for the length of the table straight. You'd have to drop this one in dead weight to finish on the black. And the cue ball drifts to the right. Let's see if we can see it. Fall. Yeah, well, there wasn't much you could do. Anthony Didn't Hamilton want to risk fall. playing it dead weight. Damage done, just the four points given away. Another good safety. This is more like it from Hamilton.
Well, that's how to play a two-cushion escape, isn't it? Could not have hit that any better. And now it's Hamilton that's got the same type of shot. The Temple Drum in all its glory. A two and a half thousand seater arena. And by common consent, one of the very best on the circuit now. The players love playing here. What a nice kiss off the pink for Anthony. did well to get the cue ball back down the table but it has pushed a red towards this right corner a chance for Hamilton not easy Good pot, and that cue ball's coming out to Bork. So this is a reasonable chance. Anthony Hamilton. Just one break of significance from Hamilton so far, the 66 he made in frame three. He's overscrewed it. Done that a couple of times today. Three. Left himself a very tough pot to the left corner. Good recovery. Four. Well, he's fighting. He's played some good safety in this frame. Now he's got a score. Six. Good play for the pink into the middle. Pink into the left corner, same pocket as the red. Screw for the blue. You could even play for the black, which is not recommended. Michael Georgiou, meanwhile, has kept his match alive against Ding Zhongwei over on table three. It's now 4-2 to Ding. across it and he's left the red on Anthony Hamilton six just a little bit of movement that's all there has to be
Well, he doesn't want to start missing. And he only needs one frame. And he's only been past the round of 32 once this season. That was at the World Open. Only been in the last 16 twice in his career. So it is a big match for him, this. And Anthony is starting to play a bit better. Oh. Two reds by the pink spot, the lower one will certainly go. It could have worked out. <laughs> Trying to catch that red full in the face, which would have left him on the black. Seven. Big frame has just come to a conclusion over on table four, hence the prolonged applause. It's gone the way of Joe Perry on the final black. A couple of huge flukes from Hugh Delu in that frame. It could have been 4 2 in the event, tied up at three each. Nice flick there. Oh, can Hamilton see the edge of these reds? If not, then it's a good safety. You can just see them. Caught them a little bit thick. It's okay, this red very thin to the right corner. Robertson looking for one good chance to seal this frame a match. Well, that's another half chance. Has it knocked in many of those shots to nothing? Maybe a chance to bring the black into play here. For Jimmy Robertson playing around the three cushions, try and drop in behind the brown. That's pretty good. Good safety. Plenty of danger here. <laughs> and that's just what's happened. And now a chance. Jimmy Robertson, great chance this. It was a good safety that he played, but he caught this red much too thin.
one. And get the pink back on its spot. Makes the brake building easier. The only question left now for Jimmy Robertson, having put himself in a match-winning situation, is can Seven. he deliver that final thrust? Can he deal with the nerves? This would be one of the biggest wins of his career. We've mentioned he's only been to the last 16 of a ranking event twice Eight. before. Turn pro way back in 2002. He's certainly got the ability, without a doubt. I've seen him play two or three times. And he's been unfortunate in those instances. He has played well. And I think he has got bottle. 13. And he's going to have to prove it now. But if he can keep that cue ball under control. Where has he come too far? Well, that's just what he can't afford to do. Jim Roberts sends 20. a very clear message, doesn't it, to Anthony Hamilton that this match is by no means done. Yes, Hamilton's 4 1 down in a race to five, but. Robertson clearly feeling it inside of victory. Yeah, what happens is you try and make sure of the red. And you finish up missing it. So let off though. Unfortunately, the red has run safe. That's the problem. Hamilton's just not playing well enough at the moment to capitalise on his opponent's errors. Just one break of any note. Virtually nothing else. Well, I think it's worth taking this red on down the cushion. Got to try and win the match. Well, that's a good safety, though. It's how you see the frame. And if you didn't fancy the red, then don't take it on. Managed to cover that one nearest the pocket. Which leaves Hamilton in a bit of trouble, because if he plays the cue ball back down the table, he may leave that red on closest to the right corner. Just caught it a little bit too thin. And that's why the cue ball's come in and out of balk. This red, very tough. But it was a chance. And Jimmy's knocked it in. He needs to finish top One. side of the blue. Now he's got to take the pink. But that red near the left middle pocket is available. Could also play the cannon to those two reds. That's on the black cushion. And 
And that's what he's done. It hasn't been fortunate. Still got the red to the left middle, but Seven. it's very difficult from there. This is the cannon again. Could have done with catching that red from behind. Doesn't have to take the pot on. Thinking of taking this red on to the right corner. It's a tough red, this, to the middle. Oh, what a good shot. That Eight. could be a frame winner and match winner. That's a terrific shot. Now, may play for the black this time round. If it's touching the cushion... 13. It's easy enough. Fourteen. For the pink, and he's got a nice angle to bring that red off the cushion and stay on the red down the cushion. Yes. Again, decided to play for this loose red. Looks like it could have been a heavy contact as well. Another good shot and what another good angle on the pink to play the same shot as I suggested last time round. Now, and that's nice, he's on the red to the middle. He wanted it fuller. But that's okay, 30 points the difference. 27. And 51 on the table, 43. If and when this red disappears, Robertson edging towards the winning line. Twenty-eight. So thirty-one points the difference. Thirty-three with the yellow. So he's gonna need a colour off this red down the cushion. Little bounce. Ooh, that's too much of a bounce. Had a lot of side on the cue ball there. 30. 30. A red in any colour, but this is horrible. Well, so much so that I wouldn't be surprised if he didn't take it on. Got to try and get that cue ball in behind the brown. If he does take it on, just in case he misses it. Nowhere near. And he didn't play him behind the brown. Oh. That's a terrible shot. Jimmy Robertson, Jimmy Robertson. 13. Yeah. Anthony Hamilton, 4. Well, it was so unlikely that he was going to get the pot, so... Why not play the cue ball into a good position? <laughs> Needs a good kiss, and that one. isn't one. Thirty-two, the difference. Thirty-five remaining. Oh, what a big shot this is. If this doesn't go in, he could be leaving the red on. Thirty-four. 
Yeah, what a brave shot that was from Anthony Hamilton because he would have been out of the tournament had that not gone in. And it very nearly didn't. Seven. Well, it wasn't easy down the cushion. I expected him to get it, but it wasn't easy. So, Jimmy Robertson only needing red and colour. Yeah, or a good snooker. definitely feeling the nerves that come with being on the cusp of a very significant win and you get the feeling that if Hamilton could get out of this frame this match is far from done well that's a big if didn't want that kiss on the pink now does Jimmy Robertson take this red on if he potted the red Hamilton could only tie but it's a difficult pot. <coughs> Why play it so hard? Although he has got away with it. Could have just played to pot the red, leave the cue ball by the black spot. Yeah, a rueful smile indeed. Missed the red by a, a margin, but he snookered Hamilton on it. And not easy. moments Hamilton's got to hit the red and get it safe and it's difficult to hit twenty six points behind well that's a good hit but look where the red's gone that's it for Hamilton couldn't have hit it any worse. One. Anthony Hamilton played some terrific snooker 12 months ago here at the Temple Drum. Beat some of the world's finest to claim his first ever ranking title. Today, nothing like that form. Jimmy Robertson has been solid. He's certainly shown nerves inside of the winning line, but Six. this is a very significant win for him. It's not been a match of the highest quality, but Robertson won't care a jot about that. He's through to the last 16. 11. Either Gary Wilson or Martin Gould, former champion here, next in line. And Anthony Hamilton, Robertson, 11. barring snookers, can look forward to a few days' holiday here in Berlin. Four snookers. I think he wants to squeeze every last ounce of his German Masters title defence. Jimmy Robertson will be feeling pretty good inside. Yes, he won't mind him playing on. He knows that he's going through to the next round. Yeah, 
Um, That's surely it. Anthony Hamilton's German Masters title defence is over here at the Temple Drum and Jimmy Robertson scores one of the biggest wins of his professional career just the third time he's made it through to the round of 16 in a ranking event it was tight it was edgy for him at the end but he wins pretty comprehensively when you look at that scoreline 5-1 big win for Robertson